Not very long ago, I lost someone last October, and he was about a seven days or six days into a wrecked body. And he always looked at me and my spirituality with some relative disdain. But he knew it was time, and he said, I don't know what to do. And I said, well, now is not the time to give you a primer. <laughs> You're going to have to commit at some point. And I reminded him one day we were at the bottom of a hill looking at this big snowmobile hill. We were with a bunch of guys, and they all said, Kelsey, no woman's ever gone up this. And I looked at this big-ass thing, and I went, well, not me. And Bruce looked at me, and he said, you can do it. All you've got to do is commit. And I said, yeah, and he said, yeah. So I did, and I did. And I reminded him of that story as he was laying in the, lying in this hospital bed, a bloody wreck. And I said, darling, you've got to commit now. You either need to commit to live, or you have to commit to die. Because if you stay in this middle place, it's going to get real yucky closed his eyes and he said okay and he did when you want to step up in your lives to commit to life go to your heart to discover the truth thank you